Hi everyone. Well, this is vlog number 12. And this one is going to be his entire titled How My Cerebral Palsy Affects My Daily Life. So, it's the ones who have been watching me vlog from day one will know I have disabilities. Cerebral palsy being one of them. Um, the way the way it affects me is it affects my grip. So I don't want really to about to say this very well, but I can't grip a lot of that good. Um, so it affects me. Um, me, well, <laughs> me fan motor skills. So I can't. I struggle with lifting things and keeping up. I even have to be careful. <laughs> I'm sort of even just lifting a cup of coffee, I have to be very careful because obviously my, because my grip has got worse over the years. Um, the, my hand grip, I, I use that as, as often as I can to try and um, make my grip a little bit stronger, but um, it helps a little bit, but um, my grip still, it, it's never going to be bit 100%. Um, and it also affects my balance. I have got, I will include um, photos of my feet and my hands. <laughs> I don't, <I'm, laughs> I don't my feet aren't exactly pretty feet, but I don't think feet are meant to be pretty anyway, <laughs> are they? Um, so I've just, I'm, I'm, I, mean, I haven't got the equipment, I can't exactly show you my feet while I'm filming, so. I've had to put a separate photo on because I haven't got the equipment to be able to um, I haven't got a phone stand or anything so it's not like I can put my phone on the stand and show you my feet that way because I haven't got a phone stand so obviously I've had to do the pictures separately um, so another way it affects me is it does affect my balance but I have got an iron step as well so like obviously the curved part with my eyes, that the the curved part of your foot, you know, where you, where you check, you know, so you know which um, foot's picture and that bit is the arch part is basically higher up, it's more higher than whatnot. So I've got to can't put my feet flat, so um, yeah, so it, yeah, it affects my balance. Um, I do get um, if I'm um, holding some, I, if I have some from so I, I get, I tend to get a bit randic. Um, I, 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 I'm hoping that I don't get that like, off artists in my hands when, when I get older, but yeah, I've noticed. Um, and that's, I don't know, for the five years that um, I get more and more bandaged in, and if I hold something for too long, it, my hands really hurt. Um, so I have to keep taking a break from things. <laughs> That's why I do want to get a phone stand so that I can put my phone on a stand and then I can be, make it easier for me to do these videos. So I am going to invest in some bit better equipment to make it just make life easier for me when I'm doing the videos. And obviously make them a bit better quality for a few lot. Um, so <laughs> that's basically... Um, the way it affects me. Um, but as I have said many, many times, my disabilities have never and will never <laughs> um, define me. They're not, it's, I'm still a human being, I still, I can still do, I can still pretty much do things what um, a normal person, I suppose, but some will be not, there's no such thing as normal, but you know what I mean, somebody who, Without disabilities, to be able to do, but um, I do. I know my limits. <laughs> I mean, I can. I try and lift as as much as I can. I do try, sometimes I get. I have been on when I when I was living on my own to go to China, get a bit carried away, and then I'd be struggling to carry the bag. <coughs> Excuse me, but um, I try my best, you know, to live as normal life as possible. 
Um, I don't let it affect me and anybody. Obviously, yeah, it does affect me a bit. I don't let it affect me too much. It does, you know, carry on as though when I know that uh, with things such as that housework, I know that would take me a bit longer to do. Um, I know certain daily, certain things, well, um, well, I suppose some doing this once is what type of, you know, the lifting, you know, carrying shopping, um, doing housework, obviously, I know, it, it, like we lift, I could only lift a certain amount, um, and I have to be very, very careful when I'm carrying things, um, but I work around it, um, if I'm taking things, you know, so I'll just take um, I spent so much at a time I'll get somebody to help me um, but I, because I'm fiercely independent I usually try my best um, with things like even like opening a bottle of milk or opening a jar when they get some jars and I swear the, the glue will lead on <laughs> I, know, I know they don't but it just feels like they do sometimes and I get quite frustrated with my family to learn it. I don't really even want to come out and do so I don't know what I say to myself, but I always try, I will try my best. And then literally, if I, if I literally cannot do it, then I will ask for help. Um, <coughs> but yeah, I'll try and um, do things myself as much as I can. Um, I don't like asking for help to be perfectly honest. Um, but yeah, if you if you have any any questions at all, um, just yeah, pop them in the comments. I'm happy to answer any questions. Um, but yeah, I just wanted to <laughs> to do a video and you know, just explain. Um, uh, because I have mentioned Miss Elba Pauls and I have mentioned Miss Colossus. Which I will be doing a video on my scoliosis in the very near future. Um, and I will try, and try my best to get a picture of my spot as best I can. I haven't got a particularly good mirror at so I'm going to have to try and work, work around that somehow. I was hoping to have got a full length mirror be, before now, but not at the money, so I'll work around it somehow. I'll have to I'll sort something out for that so I'm hoping I can get a, a decent picture for you so you can see. <laughs> the only way I could uh, um, describe that is it's basically curved in like an S shape. Oh god, excuse me. <laughs> so, um, I'm quite a thing coming in. <laughs> that's to, but yeah, that, that's basically, as I said, it doesn't, it doesn't affect when I. I've been, I was bored with it, so it's, I've um, been caught up with it for just over, four, just over four to six years, so, yeah, I've kind of got, I've, I have me, where's a working man thing, you know, um, I've worked around it, like we, just as when, when my kids was, um, I won't mention the names, obviously, but when, uh, when me, Youngest was was a bit of a baby. If I'm bathing, or um, I would take I'd um, empty the bath out first, and then wrap a towel around it so that I could get her out of the bath safely. Because obviously I didn't want to drop her. Um, so I had my little ways of just working around whatever I'm doing, so that I can do it um, normally. <laughs> Um, so yeah, that's, as I said, that's how it affects um, my daily life. <laughs> um, I have been told, yeah, that some of my disabilities and my uh, health problems could get worse. And I have been told that I could end up in a wheelchair, which, fingers crossed, so excuse me, I think, <laughs> fingers crossed doesn't happen, but if it does, I cross that bridge when I come to it. <coughs> um yeah, at the moment I'm you know, I'll still carry on doing what I can do. Um well I can just you know, make most of I make the most of every day sort of thing, so you know, just 
carry on as normal. As I said, my limits. I know what I can do, I know what I can't do. So, but I'll try and do as much as I can um, while I still can. So, I no, I make the most of it for day. Um, because you know, I never know, I could, tomorrow I could be in a wheelchair, but next year I could be in a wheelchair. And as I say, the touch wood, fingers crossed, it doesn't happen, but as, as I've just said, <coughs> I'll cross that picture when I come to it. Um, um, <coughs> for the finish, if you enjoy this video, um, my other videos, um, as I say, this will be on both channels. So, whether you're watching on Ellen's Naughty Angels, Laundry and Positivity, or you're watching on Ellen's Vlog, please like, comment, and subscribe. And also hit the bell icon. And if you choose the old videos option, you will then be notified of all my videos. I just want to say massive, massive thank you for all the support with my vlogs. <coughs> I mean, it's not so well to me. So, a big massive thank you to all of you. You know, you don't know who you are. There's a lot too many of you to mention. There's a, a lot of you. You, you know who you all are. Um, and obviously, <laughs> without you guys, I wouldn't be. I wouldn't be carrying on doing this. And when I was, I didn't know. Um, <laughs> well, this was gonna go. I mean, this is the reason why I set up my second channel because the vlogs just, just it's just blown me away. The co the comments have been amazing. So, um, big thank you to you guys. Love to you all, and. I will speak to you all again soon. Bye.